next most important thing, and I talk about this in the book, so I won't spend too much time on it, is blood sugar regulation. Why? Every time your blood sugar drops, which happens after it goes too high or after you skip meals, so a meal with too much sugar in it or carbohydrates, or when you're skipping meals because you're so busy, it releases stress hormones. You are putting yourself in a stress response. If you are waking up in the morning with anxiety, you have a blood sugar issue. No question. If you're waking up in the middle of the night feeling anxious or just waking up in the middle of the night, you have a blood sugar issue. Okay? So in the book, it goes through so the basics around how to regulate your blood sugar. Three, if you are a person that has fatigue and has health challenges, then you want to micromanage it for a while to rebuild yourself. I was tired, chronically tired for 20-something years. It was not until I learned about how to regulate my blood sugar that I fixed my fatigue. I was living paleo, not because of paleo, but because I couldn't eat anything else, right? So I lived on meat and vegetables, and I crashed my blood sugar because I wasn't getting enough glucose. So I was doing the swing thing that was keeping me chronically tired. So it's not always an issue of too much. Sometimes it can be an issue of too little. So please, make sure you go into the book and go over the section on blood sugar regulation. That's super, super important. If you look at nothing else, just you don't want to read all the stuff about chemicals and all that. You're just like, fine, I, I believe her. OK, we'll just do it. <laughs> so just go to the section where we talk about the different kinds of food and go to the section where I talk about blood sugar regulation, and then put it down, <laughs> and go shopping. <laughs>